Well, this morning we have an update on the three people who were bitten by shark attacks and two different attacks in Walton County, Florida. Yeah, two of those victims are teenagers from the Mountain Brook area. They have been identified as Lulu Gribben and McCray Faust. 48's Claudia Peppenhorst joins us live in studio. And Claudia, these attacks happened Friday just four miles apart. Well, originally beach officials closed the waters after the attacks. The waters are back open, but the fear and the sharks are still lingering. Now, this is a video from a vacationer in Walton County, Florida this weekend where you can see a shark close to the shore. Now, the first shark attack sent a 45 year old woman to the hospital where she lost the lower part of her left hand. Now we have an update on those two teens who were attacked a few miles down the shore on the same day. McCray Foss had minor injuries to her foot and has since been released from the hospital. As for Lulu Gribben, her mom posted an update about her condition on caringbridge.org, where she says the shark bit off Gribben's left hand and doctors had to amputate part of her right leg. Now, the good news is that Gribben's vitals have improved and she's been able to talk. Her first words after the attack, I made it. Vacationers are still on high alert since the attacks, but many say they're just being extra cautious and checking their surroundings. I think there's definitely been more people today that have been more aware of what's going on in the water um, and and everyone's kind of looking out for each other while also still having a good time. It's interesting to see a beach community like this where you know you got a lot of tourists coming in and Sheriff Adkinson, I think it was, um, he was here personally yesterday and you could just see it you know they were they were uh, it was traumatic for them for somebody to be hurt or injured at all but commend them for getting everybody out of the water and great to see everybody back in the water again today Gribben's mom added that they the support that they've received from around the country is overwhelming and now they're just preparing for many more surgeries to come Haley all right Claudia thank you now